I was told about this man. I grew up hearing his name. My father and my uncle used to tell me that this man is a go machine for the Super Eagles of Nigeria. He was a professional Nigerian footballer who played as a forward. He was reported to be here for an extended period of time. In 2011, news media in Nigeria began issue reports of his failing health and he was said to suffer from bipolar disorder and some other undisclosed psychiatric condition. He died in Ibadan on 4th May 2012 at the young age of 48. The news being confirmed by former national team teammates Mutu Adepoju and Ike Shoromu he was buried at his residence in Iraq, Kwara State. He was surrounded by his aged mother, brother, wives, and children, amongst others. He was born 23 October 1963 and died 4th May 2012. He is all time top goal scorer for his nation, Nigeria. He spent more than two decades during his football career, but mainly associated with Victoria de Setibel in Portugal. Scoring 37 goals for Nigeria in 62 appearances, he is the national team record goal scorer. He was part of the team that participated in 1994 FIFA World Cup in USA, where he needed Nigeria's first ever goal in a World Cup in a 3 new win against Bulgaria. His celebration after scoring and crying while holding the goal net became one of the iconic images of the tournament. He also represented Nigeria in 1998 FIFA World Cup in France. Additionally, he helped the Super Eagles of Nigeria win the 1994 Africa Cup of Nations in Tunisia, where he also topped the goal chart and was named best player of the competition. He also participated at Olympic level in Seoul 1988. In 1993, he became the first Nigerian footballer to back the African Best Footballer of the Year. In 1984, he led the Shooting Stars to the final of the African Champions Cup. He started his professional club football in the year 1981 with UNTL Kaduna where he made 30 appearances and scored 12 goals. In the year 1982, he moved to Shooting Stars where he made 53 appearances and scored 45 goals. In 1984, he moved to Abiola Babes where he made 100 appearances and scored 80 goals. In the year 1987, he moved to African Sports where he made 113 appearances and scored 105 goals. In 1990, he moved to Victoria Setuba where he made 114 appearances and scored 91 goals. In 1994, he moved to Olympiacos where he made 4 appearances and scored 2 goals. In 1995, he moved to Sporting Gijon where he made 14 appearances and scored 3 goals. In 1997, he went back to Portugal to join Victoria Setuba where he made 14 appearances and scored 3 goals. In 1997, he moved to Switzerland where he joined Zorich and made 28 appearances and scored 14 goals. In 1998, he moved to Bizete. In 1999, he moved to El Shabaab. In the same 1999, he went back to Ivory Coast to join African Sports where he made 130 appearances and scored 112 goals. In 2002, he came back to Nigeria to join Julius Vega and he made 50 appearances and scored 10 goals. Then ended his football career in 2005 with Gateway where he made 26 appearances and scored 7 goals. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you all-time Super Eagles goal scorer of all time, Rashidi Yekini. The goal machine, one of the best strikers that have ever come out from African continent, Rashidi Yekini. May your soul continue to rest in peace, Yekini Rashidi. Please, ladies and gentlemen, please, if you love this man, please don't forget to comment, share, subscribe, and as well, follow for more. Thank you.